Please describe your job title and primary duties. I first started off as a cashier, um, probably like two weeks after. They noticed that I had good customer service skills, so they put me in customer service. Then they decided to put me with food, so I've kind of worked in every one. They switch you based on how you are with customers and how independent you are. So you can be cashier one week and then two weeks later you could be like floor. What was the work environment like? Everybody was always in a good mood. They were pretty upbeat. Um, we called ourselves the coffee makers because we were always bouncing around and laughing and, and joyous. It was a cool job. Please describe a typical day as an employee. Go in, clock in, let your manager know you're there. Uh, make sure you're dressed nice. You know, you can walk in looking a little shaky, but you make sure you got your stuff tucked in and you go greet everybody, let them know you're there. And then you head to wherever your section is. Um, the biggest one about Target is the food section. You never walk in without your hat on. So always, always, always have on your hat. And all the other ones are just tucking your clothes. Make sure you look presentable. Come in with a smile. That's a part of their attire. So make sure you're wearing one. And I mean, the environment was awesome. It's clean. It's not one of those places that everything is everywhere. They're very stickler on where everything goes. And it, it, it was an awesome job just because of that too. It was a lot of organization. How would you describe the application and interview process? The application was like 45 minutes. It took a long time. They asked a lot of those questions like, uh, what would you do in this situation? The application is the way you get in though. Like if you don't do that right, then you don't get in at all. You don't even get a phone call. Um, I honestly believe that without the application, they don't have anything to actually have to interview because once you get to the interview part after they called you for the application, you're practically in. They go off everything on the application. Um, the best thing to do is to make sure you have a resume. They give you the option to have one or to not have one, have one. Because without that resume, you're not, they're not even going to look at your background. So make sure you got a resume, even if it says you did absolutely nothing, but smiled in the mirror all morning. Just make sure you have a resume. What questions did the interviewer ask during the job interview? Um, it was more, are you reliable? Can we count on you? How are you with other people? Hectic situations, you know, Target is one of those kind of wholesale stores. So, you know, you have to know how to handle people around the first of the month and they want to know, are you good under pressure? Are you okay with answering questions that you probably don't know the answer to, but you could find it if you paid attention? Um, one thing that the one manager asked me, and it was really weird, she asked me, on your break, what do you do? And I'm thinking, like, why would she ask about a break? But it was because she wants to know if you walk around and study the store during your break. She wants to know if you can find something without actually ever saying that, oh, I had to do that as a job. Can you tell us where the swimming pool is? Because maybe for five minutes out of your break, you just did a good circle of the store. What other advice would you give to a job seeker looking to get employment? Be friendly. Always be kind to people. Um, make sure you have everything ready. Don't say, um, I've said a lot of ums in this interview, but do not say, um, don't think, you know, just go with what you really think it is. If you are, if you have anything negative to say, don't say it. <laughs> just be as friendly as possible. Make sure your attire is together and follow up. That is the key to target. Follow up. They barely call people. If they call you, it's because they really need to hire, but my, I feel like if you really want to get in, call two days after you put in your application just to let them know. And then call four days later just to let them know one more time. And then on that fifth day, they'll either call you or you call them back and they'll say, okay, just come in for an interview because we're sick of seeing your number and our caller ID. So just call, 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 stay on it, smile, present yourself, and you're in.